So when you store your data in the cloud, like your pictures, videos, documents, etc., what you're functionally doing is taking all that information and putting it on a computer somewhere in the world that you don't own. But what if there was a way to have your own private server at a cost effective price? Because technically, I guess you could go to like a web host and get dedicated email hosting or even a full on server, but you're still technically renting the server from the hosting company itself instead of owning it. But now there is a cost effective solution found at Get Umbrella. Com. What's up everybody, welcome back to the channel. My name is David and in this video, I wanna discuss what getumbro.com is, why you should be aware of it and how to use it. So let's get started. So what the heck is Umbro? What are we even talking about? Well, Umbro is an operating system. It's a type of software that's based on Raspberry Pi. It's available completely for free and you can view all the source code on a GitHub. Umbro was specifically built for running a Bitcoin and a Lightning Network node. Umbro was purposefully built to run a Bitcoin and Lightning Network network node, but now allows you to run your own personal server. So as it's your own personal server, it's pretty cool because you can store your own data like pictures, videos, files, etc. Now is this overkill? Absolutely. Like for most people, I think maybe just getting an external hard drive or using something like Google Drive is totally fine and acceptable in most use cases. But if you're a little bit more privacy focused, it is an interesting alternative solution. And it's also helpful if you want to store like data that's a little bit more sensitive, like your passcodes, your Bitcoin seed phrases, etc. So what are some benefits of using getumbrella.com? Now, fundamentally speaking, this is kind of how I think maybe the internet could go in the future. We're talking like five, 10 years into the future where you kind of own your little piece of the network. And that's something that we can't even kind of grasp and understand today because it's just so cost prohibitive to have your own server software, your own files and data on your own thing in your house or wherever it is you're, you're working from. But I could see how it could become decentralized over a long enough time as cost come down. Now, specifically regarding umbrella.com, one huge thing that I really like is it allows you to support your own Bitcoin node, as well as your own Lightning Network node. Nodes are very simple. They simply verify transactions on the Bitcoin blockchain, and it helps keep everything decentralized which is clearly something that's going to be very important in the future because you're helping build a bridge to the next monetary system just in case inflation goes parabolic instead of the next dog coin. Another big benefit is that you can connect your wallet directly to your Bitcoin node, which you're running in your house. The benefit of that is that you cut out the middleman. So if you're using something like a software wallet, for example, well, they have their own servers and infrastructure that are interacting with the blockchain. And so now you can just cut the middleman out and connect your wallet directly to your Bitcoin node. So you're connecting to the Bitcoin network directly. In short, there is no data shared between you and a software wallet provider. Apps. There's tons of free and open source apps that you can use with this operating system. For example, you can use Nextcloud with Umbra. And so Nextcloud is just a free and open source file management system. Think of it as an alternative to Google Drive. You can use Photo Prism, which helps you organize, manage, tag, share your photos and videos in a private way. You can even use third-party Bitcoin apps like BTC Pay Server, which is pretty impressive. It's a completely free and open source payment processor that you can install. So you can start accepting Bitcoin payments with no third party and zero transaction fees. So how exactly do you get started? Well, you have two options. You can either go to something like bitcoinmachines.com and they sell a device with Umbro already installed. And so once you get the device, all you do is plug it into your router, follow the installation process, and that's pretty much it. Or you can build your own Bitcoin node using different components, put everything together, and then install Umbro. Now, while that may seem a bit confusing and complicated and a bit intimidating, anyone who's built a computer knows that it's really not that difficult. You just get the motherboard, processor, RAM sticks, uh, hard drive, and then put everything together and get a power source. Instead of getting a traditional motherboard, what you're going to have to get your hands on is a Raspberry Pi 4, which is just a single board computer with everything soldered onto it. Okay, so if you're interested in actually doing this, this is getumbrel.com. Now let's go ahead and click on this button where it says buy an Umbrel server. So it's going to navigate us down here. And if we click on this big button, it's going to navigate us to the bitcoinmachines.com. And then it's going to be a product page for the machine with Umbrel already installed and in good to go. So you just buy it, install it to your uh, computer. That's pretty much it. Very simple plug and play, ready to go. Now, if we come down here, it tells you what you need to do this on your own. So you are going to have to get a few different components, nothing too complicated. A Raspberry Pi 4, which you can 
purchase on Amazon. So this one, for example, is not currently available, but this is what you need. Then you're going to need one terabyte SSD, an SSD enclosure, 16 gigabytes micro SD, power supply, ethernet cable, and a case. Then it walks you through the process about how to install everything once you purchase all the products and just very simple, walks you through about now next to download the Umbrella operating system, how to install everything, and just go through the rigmarole to get set up. It's a little technical, but not too technical. I think you can handle it. Uh, but again, there's always just purchasing the machine with Umbra already installed from the Bitcoin machine. All right, everyone, that's it for this video on Get Umbro, create your own personal server. I think it's a pretty interesting development and something to definitely consider checking out, uh, particularly running a Bitcoin node in the Bitcoin Lightning Network node. I think that's really helpful and interesting. I think it's really interesting because you can connect your wallet directly to a Bitcoin node and you can set up something like BTC Pay so you can start accepting cryptocurrency payments directly without any third party and zero transaction fees. Anyways, I'll just leave it there. My name is David from WebsiteCreatePro.com. Thank you very much for watching and have a great day.